Is Duracell Basic really that good? The truth. You've seen this bunny before, right? You know that Duracell Basic makes it drum longer than other batteries can, right? But is that really the case? Let's see. Take a moment to subscribe to whatcell.org if you want to stay updated on energy storage devices like batteries and supercapacitors and leave comments to win monthly giveaways. Today we are testing Duracell Basic. Is it really as good as it promises? A single piece in a 4-pack costs 0.98 euros. On Amazon I found them for $1.45, but bulk prices can go a bit lower. This is how we measure performance. The basic setup is really simple. We have a battery, a resistor, and some voltage measuring device. We discharge the battery through a carefully calibrated resistor. In the process we measure voltage and time. And that's it. From there on, everything is calculated. Ohm's law gives us electric current in time, and the area under the graph is electric charge. Ohm's law also gives us electric power, and the area under this graph is electric energy. And this is how Duracell performed compared to currently best cell on whatcell.org. Duracell Basic on average packed 615.5 milliamp hours at 11.3 grams. In performance category, it is currently just behind Duracell Procell Industrial, but far from being as impressive as one would expect from the Pink Bunny. In the performance price categories, it's currently in the one before last place simply because it's so expensive and nothing special on top of it. So the bottom line is, I guess the pink bunny wasn't telling us the whole truth. Share, like and subscribe to get more of this. Next we are having interesting cheap rechargeable batteries Dolly Dada Red and Green, promising 1800 mAh of charge, which is twice as much as the best battery currently on whatcell.org.